I want to talk about dinosaurs. 我想同大家讲下恐龙。Many people wonder how can dinosaurs fit into the Bible. 好多人都奇怪，恐龙点样可以符合圣经咧 ？But that's because they think dinosaurs lived millions of years ago. 因为佢哋觉得恐龙系喺几千万年前生存嘅。Whereas the Bible says that everything was made in those six days. 圣经讲所有嘢都系喺嗰六日里边创造出嚟。So that has to include the dinosaurs. 咁即系包括埋恐龙啦。Which means that at some point, people must have known about dinosaurs. 咁即系话人喺某段时间就知道恐龙嘅存在。According to long age belief， 根据年老宇宙学说 ，no one has ever seen a dinosaur。应该冇人见过恐龙。Because they believe that the last dinosaur died 65 million years before the first man came。因为佢哋相信最后一只恐龙。系喺第一个人类出现之前嘅六千五百万年前已经死咗。But if people did live with dinosaurs once， 如果人真系同恐龙一齐生活过 ，you would expect there to be some cultural memories。你就会预计得到佢哋应该有一啲文化上嘅记录。And so it's not surprising to find， 所以我哋唔出奇会发现一啲。That everywhere around the world we have stories of creatures that were very similar to dinosaurs. 全世界有好多故事，里边嘅动物都有啲似恐龙。And I'm talking about the dragons. 我哋讲紧龙王。And of course, these change with telling and retelling these the stories. 咁当然啦，当一个传一个之后，个故事就会有啲改变咗。But There's not a single culture in the world without stories of big reptiles. 但世界上每一个文化都有一个大爬虫类嘅故事流传。Even the flag of Wales in England. 甚至喺英格兰威尔斯嘅旗上边。But what's even more interesting than hearing stories? 但比听故事更加有趣嘅就系 ，is when you see what people drew. 就系佢哋啲人画嘅嘢。For example, this brass carving. 例如，我哋睇下呢个黄铜嘅雕刻。It comes from Carlisle Cathedral in the United Kingdom. 系嚟自英国嘅一个大教堂里边。And it's about six hundred years old. 有大约六百年嘅历史。Here's another one from the same part of the same cathedral. 呢度有另一个系嚟自同一间大教堂里边嘅。Now. If that's not trying to draw dinosaurs, 如果佢哋唔系想画恐龙的话 ，I don't know what it's drawing. 咁我唔知佢哋想画乜嘢啦。But remember, they didn't have any dinosaur books back then. 但系你要记住，佢哋嗰阵时系冇一啲恐龙嘅书籍。They didn't have the experience of generations of scientists. 佢哋亦都冇几代科学家所遗留落嚟嘅经验。Trying to work out from the fossil bones. 由啲骨化石里边知道点样画。Work out from the fossil bones what it would have looked like. 佢哋都冇尝试喺啲骨化石里边睇下啲恐龙系咩样嘅。There is a a set of ruins, ruined temples in Cambodia. 喺柬埔寨里边有一座损毁咗嘅庙宇。It's called Angkor Wat. 系叫吴哥窟。Everybody agrees that these ruins are many hundreds of years old. 好多人都会同意呢一个位置系有几百年嘅历史。Some of you might have seen the film Lara Croft Tomb Raider。可能有啲人都睇过一套电影叫做《盗墓者罗拉》。Anybody seen it? Yeah, okay. They they used the temple ruins as a set。佢哋用嗰个庙宇嘅位置嚟做个场景。You could see how old the ruins were。你可以睇到呢个位置有几耐嘅历史。Because of these big trees growing over them, because there are big trees that hold them in place. And on the carvings on those walls, and on the carvings on those walls, you see this creature. You will see this creature. Has anybody ever seen anything like that before? Have you ever seen anything like that before? Has anybody ever seen anything like that before? Has anybody ever seen anything like that before? Has anybody ever seen anything like that before? What's the name of it? 佢咩名啊
In English, it's called a stegosaurus. 中文就叫剑龙啊。People wonder why doesn't the Bible mention dinosaurs? 有啲人好出奇，点解圣经都冇讲恐龙嘅 ？Well, actually, dinosaurs do feature in the Bible. 其实恐龙喺圣经里边都有出现过嘅。In the King James Bible， 喺英皇钦定本里边 ，which is the first Bible translated into English， 佢系第一个圣经翻译成英文嘅版本。That was two two hundred years before the word dinosaur was invented。呢个版本系喺恐龙呢个字 dinosaur 出现之前二百年前翻译成嘅。So you won't find the word dinosaur。所以你唔会揾到恐龙呢一个字，但你会揾到英文字龙 dragon 呢个字。Many times， 仲好多次添。And in Job chapter forty verse fifteen， 喺约伯记四十章十五节 ，you will find God talking about the biggest land grass-eating creature he ever made。你就會發現神所提及佢創造嘅最大陸上食草嘅動物。And he says to Job, behold behemoth。神對約伯話：你且觀看河馬。In Bibles like the Chinese Bible or the Indonesian Bible， 喺中文聖經同埋印尼聖經裏邊 ，behemoth is translated elephant or hippopotamus。behemoth 就會被翻譯成為大象或者河馬。But that's not what The Hebrew original says. 但系呢个唔系原本希伯来文嘅意思。That's just people trying to guess what this biggest creature could be. 呢个只系啲人尝试估下呢一只最大嘅动物系乜嘢。Because it actually says in Job that behemoth has a tail like a cedar tree. 其实喺约伯记里边，佢话 behemoth 系有一条好似香柏树咁粗嘅尾。Now I've seen the big thick trunk of a cedar tree. 我都见过香柏树有一个好粗嘅树干。And I've seen an elephant's tail. 我都见过大象嘅尾。Job was written in the land of Uz. 约伯记系喺乌斯地里边写成嘅。Uz was a descendant of Shem. 乌斯就系闪嘅后代。And Shem was on the ark. 而闪就喺方舟里边。Which means that dinosaurs came through the flood. 即系话恐龙避过咗大洪水 ，which makes sense because God said take two of every kind of land creature on board。咁系好合理噶，因为神话每种陆上嘅动物都带两只上方舟。Now people wonder how do you fit the dinosaurs on board the ark？ 咁啲人就会问，恐龙点样可以摆得入方舟咧 ？But most dinosaurs were actually very small。但系大部分嘅恐龙，其实佢哋体积都系好细。Many of them fully grown were only the size of a chicken。好多成年嘅恐龙，其实佢哋嘅体积都好似系一只鸡咁大。So the average size was probably a little bit bigger than a sheep。所以佢哋平均嘅体积都只系比一只羊大少少。But there's a few big ones, isn't there？ 但系有少数都好大噶，系咪？ And they're too big to even get through the door of the ark. 佢哋大到连入方舟嗰道门都入唔到。But there's a very easy way for God to solve that problem. 神亦都有一个好简单嘅方法嚟解决呢个问题。Because even the biggest dinosaur comes from a very small egg. 因为最大嘅恐龙都系由一只好细嘅蛋而嚟。So that means they were once very small baby dinosaurs. 即系话佢哋都曾经系一只好细嘅 B B 恐龙。Which became which became children dinosaurs. 然后就变咗小恐龙。Which means why should God take big mother and father on the ark? 咁即系话神冇需要带大嘅爸爸妈妈恐龙上船。When a couple of teenagers would have done just fine. 相反，神只要带一对年青嘅恐龙上船就可以啦。So people ask, what happened to the dinosaurs? 咁好多人问啲恐龙去咗边咧 ？The answer is very easy. 个答案系好简单。They died out. 佢哋绝咗种咯。In my lifetime, over four hundred different species died out. 喺我一生嘅时间，已经有超过四百种唔同嘅物种都绝咗种啦。It happens for many different reasons. 可以系好多唔同嘅原因而造成嘅。
but many times it's because of what people do. 但系好多时都系因为人为嘅因素而造成嘅。For example, we used to have giant animals in Australia. 例如我哋喺澳洲曾经就有一啲好大嘅动物。Like giant kangaroos. 例如巨型嘅袋鼠咯。Our Aboriginal people hunted them. 我哋嘅土著居民猎杀佢哋。And that's why they're all gone. 咁所以佢哋就冇晒咯。But if you're trying to catch food for the family， 咁如果你为屋企人出去狩猎嘅时候 ，it makes sense to go for the bigger one。好自然你就会打只大啲嘅咯。But people never think that the dinosaurs could have died out because of people too。但系啲人冇谂过，其实恐龙绝种同样可以系因为人嘅缘故。Because they've been brainwashed into thinking there were no people there。因为人都被洗脑，以为有恐龙嘅时间就唔会有人。But even in the history of the United Kingdom， 但系即使喺英国嘅历史里边 ，you have the account of how one man killed a dragon in a lonely cave， 都有记述一个人点样喺山洞里边杀死一条龙。His name is Saint George， 佢个名叫圣佐治。And his cross features on the United Kingdom flag。佢嘅十字架标记都出现喺英国嘅国旗上边。Maybe he wasn't very careful about conservation。可能佢唔系好关注呢个保育。But what I'm getting at is that it's not a mystery why they died。但系我想讲嘅，佢哋绝种其实唔系一个谜。It's only a mystery for long age thinkers。只系对年老宇宙学说嘅人嚟讲，先至系一个谜。Because they believe in an age of dinosaurs， 因为佢哋相信一个恐龙嘅时代。And then after that, an age of no dinosaurs， 之后就系一个冇恐龙嘅时代。So they ask, hey, what happened？ 所以佢哋会问，吓，发生咩事啊 ？And that and that's why they try to look for big explanations。所以佢哋点解就会揾一啲好大嘅原因 ？Like they believe that a meteorite that hit the Earth killed the dinosaurs。好似佢哋相信有一颗小行星撞咗落地球，将所有恐龙杀晒。But even many evolutionists have problems with that idea。但系好多进化论者都对呢一个解释存有疑问。But there's even more important evidence about dinosaurs。但系我仲有好多关于恐龙嘅重要证据。Let me explain that if you take a fresh chicken bone， 等我解释一下，你攞一嚿新鲜嘅鸡骨 ，and you dissolve it in a weak acid like vinegar。你用一啲藥酸，例如好似醋咁嚟溶解咗佢。That's a good experiment to do with your children。呢個都係一個好好嘅實驗，同你嘅小朋友一齊做噶。That gets rid of all the mineral from the bone。咁樣做就會將裏邊嘅礦物質全部攞走曬。And it leaves behind the protein。留翻低嘅就只係有蛋白質。Which is the soft, flexible stuff。就係嗰啲柔軟而有彈性嘅物質。But no one would have believed it possible. 但系冇人会谂过 that if you did that to a fossil dinosaur bone, 你重复呢个实验，但系今次系用恐龙骨化石 that you would have soft, flexible tissue left. 你就会有柔软而有弹性嘅组织剩翻出嚟 This was reported in major evolutionary journals. 呢个曾经喺一本主要嘅进化论期刊里边报道过。And not just things like ligaments， 唔单止系有韧带 ，but transparent branching flexible blood vessels， 仲有一啲透明分支弹性嘅血管。And inside them there was an ooze like toothpaste that could be squeezed out。里边有啲好结嘅嘢，好似系一啲牙膏咁可以挤出嚟。And when you looked at that stuff under the microscope。当你喺显微镜里边睇呢啲物质嘅时候 ，you see these red blood cells with nuclei。你会睇到一啲有细胞核嘅红血球。And they have have identified several different proteins。佢哋都揾到几种唔同嘅蛋白质。Now you need to understand what an incredible shock this is for a long age believer。你要知道，对于相信年老宇宙学说嘅人嚟讲，呢一个系一件好震撼嘅事。Because remember。These have to be at least 65 million years old in their belief system。因为你要记住，佢哋相信呢啲骨最少有六千五百万年嘅历史
And these proteins are complicated, fragile molecules. 呢啲蛋白质系一啲复杂、脆弱嘅分子。That naturally fall apart with time. 会随住时间而自然咁分解。According to the laws of physics and chemistry. 根据物理同埋化学嘅定律。There shouldn't be any left way before this sort of time has passed. 经过咁长嘅时间，应该系完全分解晒，而且冇得剩噶啦。But this tells you that this whole issue has to do with more than facts。呢样嘢就话俾我哋听，成件事唔单止只系讲出一个事实咁简单。Because these facts point very strongly to the fact that dinosaurs are young。呢啲事实好强烈地指出，恐龙其实系好年轻嘅。But if the Bible's right about history。但系如果圣经所讲嘅历史系正确的话 ，then it's also right about everything else。咁其他讲嘅嘢都应该系正确噶啦。Which means we all sinners。即系话我哋全部都系罪人。And without Christ, we're headed for judgment。如果冇基督，我哋就会面对审判。And that's something that the natural man does not want to believe。呢个系一个正常人都唔想面对嘅事。So they now say that, well, we don't understand why. But somehow, these things have lasted for millions of years. 佢哋而家话好，我哋其实唔知点解会有咁嘅事情发生，但系因为某种情况之下，佢哋就保存咗几千万年。